Hello friends, happy Tuesday. So for today's music class, we are going to read this story right here. The story is called, But Mom, Everybody Else Does, by Kay Winters, pictures by Doug Cushman. We're reading this story because there is a very special holiday coming up very soon on May 11th, and that is Mother's Day. So this week, we're going to do a bunch of musical Mother's Day related activities, songs, dances, all that fun stuff. And I especially want you to do those songs and dances with your moms or your grandmas or your aunts, any special women in your life that we celebrate on Mother's Day. Let's get started. But mom, Everybody has a messy room. Nobody has to wear boots. Please, Mom. Everybody's getting a horse. Nobody walks to school. But mom, it's true, everybody draws better. Nobody passed the test. Extra hometown kids a washout. The world was stunned by the news that every child in the universe failed the test. Don't you see, Mom? Everybody gets a bigger allowance. Nobody has to practice. Come on, Mom, everybody else gets seconds. Nobody has to take out the trash. Mom, everybody sleeps with the dog. Nobody has to go to bed this early. Well, dear, all I know is everybody gets a good night kiss and nobody goes to bed without a hug. Good night. Good night, Mom. The end. So the song that we're gonna learn today is actually to the tune of a song we've heard a bajillion times before, but maybe you haven't. So let me give you a little refresher. This song is called London Bridge. Now London Bridge goes like this. London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. London Bridge is falling down. I think you get the point. <laughs> So what we're gonna be doing is using that tune, but with some different words. So here are those words. Those words are, thank you, mom, for all your hugs. Then I want you to say, they feel good to me. The next verse is, thank you, mom, for all your kisses. So when we go, thank you, mom, for all your kisses, I want you to go really quickly. The third verse and the final verse says, thank you, mom, for all your love. So I want everyone to make a heart with their hands. Oh, let's put that all together with the tune of London Bridge. Thank you, Mom, for all your hugs, all your hugs, all your hugs. Thank you, Mom, for all your hugs. They feel good to me. Thank you, Mom, for all your kisses, all your kisses, all your kisses. Thank 
you, Mom, for all your kisses. They feel good to me. Thank you, Mom, for all your love, all your love, all your love. Thank you, Mom, for all your love. They feel good to me. Now, I know it's been a while since we've talked about this, but do you guys remember that really silly thing that we used to do all the time called solfege? Who remembers what solfege is? I know I will never forget what solfege is. Solfege is our do, re, mi's. So let's do a little reminder on what those hand signs are, and then I want to apply them to the new song that we learned. Do looks like this. It looks like a fist. Do. Then re. We flatten out our hand on an angle. That's re. Then we go to mi, nice and flat. Then we do a thumbs down for fa. Then we show our knuckles, so. Then we put our hand downwards like this for la. Then we point up and go t. Then we have do. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. Now let's apply it to our song. Technically, the fancy schmancy word for what we're doing today is we are doing sight singing. But since you don't have the music in front of you and we're still learning how to read our music, Miss Collins is going to do the hard part and read the music and sight sing. But what I want you to focus on is doing your hand signs and your solfege singing out loud with me. I'm going to do the song with the hand signs and the solfege first, kind of fast, and then we're going to slow it down so that you can join me. So first Miss Collins, then you. But a big important part of sight singing is having a piano. Now, some of you may be thinking, well, Miss Collins, what if I don't have a piano? Well, I got good news for you. There are super cool apps that you can find on your phone or your tablet or your computer. This app is called The Piano. And look, it's like a little piano in your pocket. Isn't that cool? The first note of our song is G. And in solfege, that's actually so. So let's try practicing that together. Let's all sing so. All right. But what's do? What are all the rest of them? Do is middle C, nice and in the middle of our piano. Do. And if you remember our colors, it's green. First, let's sing a C scale. So we're going to start on C, which is do, and we're going to climb up all the way to high do. Let's start here. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. Very good. If we start on our first note, it's a G and it's so. This is how we're going to do it. So, la, so, fa, mi, fa, so, re, mi, fa. Mi, fa, so, so, la, so, fa, mi, fa, so, re, so, mi, do. Now let's slow it down, huh? 